Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're starting off our Christmas Vlogmas. It's champion Vlogmas. What are you doing mixing a mixtape? Anyways guys, so we're just prepping the stuff for the fruit cake. It's like a tradition in Jamaica. You make the Christmas fruit cake. Some people call it black cake, whatever you want to call it. And some people prepare this a year in advance. Today is what, November? Babe, hmm? why you do not eat my stuff out? This is what he does, guys. He be eating. No. He be eating my stuff out before starting. Yep, guys. So we're just gonna get into it and show you what you need to prepare for that awesome fruit cake. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Particularly, this is a uh, Christmas That's stuff, but uh, red label grape wine with artificial flavors. That's a Jamaican red label wine, yeah. And here is like a fruit wine. Yep. It's got different types of fruits and berries, or well, yep. berries, strawberries, or raspberries, blackberries. Kind of turn it around, babe. The other way, yeah. So it's fruit wine. And the other one, that's Jamaican white rum. Alright all right guys, so you're gonna need to mix all three of those and you're gonna see how it come out good. Alright, next You're getting litty. <laughs> sure you are. Alright guys, next we have raisins, prunes, and we have a fruit mix. That's like cranberries, cherries, and all that. No, I have a banana. That is not in the recipe guys. Don't listen to Phil. Do not put that in the recipe. <laughs> Alright guys, let's get started. Up, we're putting the red label wine in there. If you're making it for kids, you use a little less, but for this, um, I'll use quite a bit because you can always add more. The Jamaicans already use the recipe, but for the people that like recipes, I'll link, I'll put the recipe in the description for you guys. So, red label wine is in, fruit wine. For the fruit wine, you don't have to use that much. Let's use a little. That's a little for me. And next up we have the rum. Ooh, she make a rum punch. <laughs> Wait, there's something on this bed. Yeah, that's the cap to so you don't over pour. Oh really? Let's see how much is that? Put some more. The more rum the better. It look it will it will marinate with the fruits and make it last longer. So this, if you're making like a, I'll just put a recipe, but if you're making like a 10 pound cake, you could use like one and a half cup or three, but for me, this is two cups because I like having extra if I want to give it to somebody. Ooh, you smell that rum, babe? Nope. You need to come closer. I'm going to put some more red label wine in there. No, of course you are. The more the better. Alright guys, it's gonna get noisy. Power that on. Let's go. I'm just pausing it to like because if you watch our previous video when Bill and I tried the butter and cheese I don't really like raisin not everybody mix it up like this some people just put it all to soak I'm blending it so when you're eating a fruit cake you won't even taste a piece of the fruits in there because I don't like this so you don't have to do it this way this is my life. Ooh, now I smell it you smell it now mmm so good it's too look, much rum in there, though, guys. Don't look at me. Look at the camera. <laughs> Jesus. It's too much. Sorry, guys. I'm used to looking at it, though. Yeah. It's really... There's so much rum in there. Oh, my God. I think you need You think I overdid it? No, you didn't. <laughs> All right, guys. There you go. Bam. Guys, it's so sick. So here, I'm just, like, trying to take off as much off this as I can. You don't want nothing to waste. We don't waste nothing around here. So 
all good stuff. All right, I think I got enough of that. And we're just gonna pour it out into this container. I hope you guys can see it. Babe, you got it? Mm-hmm, I got you making a mess. Preferably, if you make this at home and you're not wanting your kids to get drunk, keep this out of reach of children. If you're making this for kids, keep the alcohol level at like 0 0.5. No, we don't condone alcohol consumption to kids. Kids eat fruit cake. You just gotta, if you're making it for kids, you gotta keep it at, at below 5%. You can make That's it. the rule. Like when you go weddings, kids eat fruitcake. There you go, guys. If your kids want a fruitcake, Walmart sells non-alcoholic fruitcake. No, they don't. You, you'll never have eat a fruit. If you if if a fruitcake don't have alcohol in it, it's not real fruitcake. That's the point. <laughs> Saint is, is in Jamaica. We can't we can't serve children alcohol. I said you can. You're not gonna serve them alcohol. You gotta keep it below 5%. Like Listerne. Listerne is alcohol. But that's besides the point, guys. <laughs> you guys don't wanna. I'm gonna make more, guys. If you, if you, guys, this... if you guys could smell this, yeah, kids will definitely be drunk. <laughs> I'm getting drunk and I haven't even tasted it. Yep, so you just make this. Put it up to soak. There you have it, guys. I'm gonna make more, fill it up, and you guys will see when we're baking. That's it. There you go, guys. Always drinking out my water. My little ingredients for my fruit cake. Aww. But there it is, guys. Fruit cake ready to store. Store it up Bye. for a month. You gonna drink both of them? <laughs> Yeah. It's not bad. It don't taste like a wine. It tastes more like it's a champagne. Fruit wine. They're all fruits. And you think wines are made but, of grapes. Duh, you know what I meant. <laughs> but there you go guys. Go prep for your fruit cake so you can do it with us. Babe, that was quick. Have some you know rum. What, you know what tonight is? What? Housewives night. <laughs> He's so into Housewife of Atlanta, guys. <laughs> it's not even funny. But there you have it. Go prep for your fruit cake so you could join us with a day before we bake it for Christmas hey guys, Day. Hey, play with me. I'll be on Xbox. <laughs> Later, guys. Some fine rings, but a different things, but we found